What's good? It's your boy Roddy Too Good. Welcome to another episode of the Pilot Show. Oh, bro. Just when you thought it was over, it's still going, bro. Drake vs. Kendrick is still kind of, it's lit. It's not, I don't think we're going to get no more songs, but it's definitely lingering on. Bro, who the, who is Ebony Prince, yo? Who is that man? Like, old women, or, well, let's say Prince, but I don't know. Well, you know how today is, bro. He could be, he could be, she could be identifying as a Prince. But anyway, yeah, bro, it's crazy today. They got, it's a person on Twitter or, Twitter or X. They got something going on. They call Ebony Prince 2K20, uh, 24. They say everybody's saying this uh, Kendrick's uh, burner. And they out there leaking information. They out there putting out some very, very uh, interesting things, man. Very, some things that I don't think nobody who got planted it would have. Like, they... They really put out a whole video of the whole thing, like the whole, uh, that whole layout that he had for Meet the Grams and all that stuff. They putting out, like, these secret pictures. Like, they putting out, like, a, a, a lobby picture from, like, a year ago talking about, yo, yo, uh, Drake, this shit remind you of how you lost all the stuff that I got. And they putting out, like, some other stuff, like some, like, it looked like it's, like, some type of, like, a top of, like, some type of paperwork. I don't know, it's getting crazy, yo. Um, I mean, yo, man. See, the thing about Drake got it. Drake had just had to understand how to just accept defeat. When you made that hard part six and you was calling people liars and all that, and then he knew he knew what he was doing. He was giving his fan base and people who mess with him some am ammunition. Because if he didn't put out that and didn't say, like, oh, this person is lying and all that, his fans would have just had to... Had to submit defeat. See, now you throw that out there, that little breadcrumb out there. People want to take it and run with it and saying, yo, he lost, but, yo, he, he ain't win, but, but. Like, yo, now it's like, but now you got this person coming out and saying, yo, like, I'm not lying, bro. I'm not a thief. I don't even know who this person is. Like, nobody knows who this person is. Nobody understands what's going on for real right now. But everybody... Everybody is watching, like, and, and and people, certain people are very, very silent, yo. He called out Drake and, and Academics by name, and they, I don't think Act really said nothing yet. Um, I think he got a video coming out, if I'm not, if I'm not saying, he got a video coming out today, but, um, I don't know, it's very, very interesting. I don't know, this is, this is kind of weird, man, this is kind of like, this is kind of like they, somebody said this the Riddler from the last Batman, like the way they just doing stuff. Like, yeah, they like videotaping all the prescription stuff, the receipts. Like, they really see back. We just had to pitch on Meet the Grands, but now they going in depth. Like, they going really like showing you like, okay, here, like, yo, look, look on the stuff like this. That, and that's really his stuff. Like, yo, his name and stuff is like some. Adderall pills and they really they showed the real uh Olympic box like not no not no just paper they showed the box like yo they showed the box they showed the receipt like people's signature and names and all that stuff on there so it's very very interesting man like yo people don't like becoming liars man like yo come on man Drake like you just gotta son you just I've been listening to the Forty Eight Laws of Power bro one of the laws is uh. No one to submit. No one to leave. No one to get up out of there, man. And that's one thing, Drake. Because now, let's say he ain't lying. Now it's going to look a thousand times worse. See, <clears throat> see what before is like you could have had plausible deniability if you didn't address it and say, yo, if you didn't address it and just let things with, let things lie, people wouldn't have really nothing to say. They probably would have said you lost the battle, but... Y'all both was, like, saying things, like, people don't really believe. Do I believe, do I believe Drake is a, a, a Geppetto? No, but I think he's, is very, very weird. But do I think Kendrick is a wife beater? No, but I don't know, man. Like, listen, man, I, I come from, I come from battle rap. Battle rap is just like that, fam. Like, yo, I'm, I'm from Jersey, so I'm going to tell y'all, fam. I, I done heard Arsenal been a bus driver since like oh oh eight 
Like, you know what I'm saying? People been, oh, you drive a bus, you a bus driver. Just that man don't even got no CDL license, man. He said it. But he was like, fam, I don't even know where this came from. Like, yo, so people always stuck on, oh, this, that, and that. Like, fam, battle rap, don't nobody care about the truth. They just want to see how you present it. Like, if you present something real, real good, that thing sound fire. But like, yo, I don't know, man. These This this new little venture and all that stuff is going on. This is very, very interesting. I don't know where Ebony Prince is going with it. Like, he's putting out a lot of information. He's tweeting a lot. His page is definitely going up. I definitely got I'm a, I followed it. But now, now that I'm making this video, I got to put the notifications up. Because I don't know. Maybe he'll pop out with a video or something. Like... Uh, Drake C, uh, Drake daughter, or something like that. But I don't know. And then they, that other, and that lobby picture was very, very weird and cryptic. Like, yo, it was like, like it was like something like TMZ would have or something like that. Like it was somebody. It was a bunch of people in the hallway. It was like somebody like in like a wheelchair or something like that. And then like you saw the person behind them was like. You saw a person clearly with an OVO shirt on and, like, some chains and all that stuff. I don't know that if that was Drake, but it definitely looked like somebody from his camp. But, um, in saying that, yeah, man, this is very, very interesting. But, um, I wanted to also talk about, yo, the new music coming out, bro. The new music, I ain't gonna lie. Ever since this beef been happening, everything been on pause. So, um, I've been, I've got a chance to listen to some new music. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie, for... Four, speaking of OVO, Four Bats, Four Bats album is fire. Four Bats album is fire. And the interesting thing is, though, um, I know he was rumored to be signed with OVO, but when you go to, like, his thing, like, at the bottom of the thing, it don't say OVO, it just say Gamma. So, I don't know. Maybe they got, like, maybe it's a management thing. Maybe it's something like that. I don't know if he's signed directly to OVO. And it says, like, when you... When you go to his thing, like, who is he signed to? It say OVO and Gamma. But when you go to his album on Apple Music, it just say Gamma. So I don't know what's going on. That's very, very interesting. And I'm, like, maybe maybe he's not signed to OVO. And to be honest with you, his career probably would help without being signed to OVO. We already know what goes on on OVO. That's the sweatshop. That's the, uh, <laughs> that's the place where your music just goes to, like, October's very own, nigga. That's, that, it's named that for a reason. It's, all your stuff is going to Drake. Like, for real, for real. Like, yo, we already know. Shout out to Drake, but we already know the truth, brother. But, um, yeah, so his, his stuff is definitely flames. Um, I'm hating, I hate the, uh, hate that he gets, the ridicule he gets, because my thing is this, we always complain about good music and good things, but people are spoiled in this little, in, in the hip hop thing, man, because y'all always want to complain about something. I heard Joe Button say that too. Oh, people are comfortable in their pocket. They don't want to go outside the box. Brother, just make good music. Like, yo, we, last year, we didn't even have good music. Like, yo, come on, man. Like, yo, as long as the music good, I really complain. Like, yo, I can, I understand what he's saying. Like, things could be repetitive. Things, you want people to go outside and go challenge themselves as artists. But in, in response to that, brother, make some good music, man. Make some good music. Like, you, this is a very, very good year for uh, hip-hop just in general. So, I'm, I'm not going to complain about that if, if you're out there putting out quality. But, but to say that. So, Gunna Drop, classic. That's it. That's it right there. It's fire. But, surprisingly, Sauce, Chief Keith. Hey, yo, what? Don't, and remember I was telling you last time about Dirty Nachos? I feel like the beat selection was, wasn't was fitting his rapping style now. It, this one, it was way, it was a way, 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 way better. Way, 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 way better. It's not... It's not as to where he was, but I could see him uh, building off this momentum. I could see him doing that. I could see him actually saying, like, okay, this project was dope. I think he need to, like, yo, even Lil Dirk put out a tweet and say, yo, Sosa back. And that's going, hey, yo, that's great. And then the news, too, came out that he's about to perform in Chicago for in uh, the last 10 years he ain't performed there, yo. Last time he performed there was 10 years ago. So that's that's interesting right there. He's about he probably about to breathe life back into Chicago, man. I don't know cuz Chicago is I mean 
It's good, but I think people just got to step away from the drill, man, and just make good music, yo. I don't know. Drill, drill is definitely interesting because drill could get you hot. But as soon as you get on, you got to stop doing that. Like, it, So it's like, is it worth investing your career in? So I don't know. So, uh, yeah, I'm, I don't know about uh, the drill and all that stuff. But, yeah, man, shout out to Sosa about that. That album is very, very, it's good, man. It's definitely something y'all should go definitely check out. I'm not mad at that. Um, but the highlight of this week, definitely gonna. I saw uh, Conway drop, too. Like, they, Conway and them drop a lot. And it's always, like, so those is, like, I got, that's the, like, the solid artist list. Like, people who. Like, yo, you just know what to expect from them, and you just know, like, like them, the whole Griselda, like, you just know what to expect from them, and they just solid. So, it's like, all right, okay. But, um, yeah, shout out to them. But, yeah, Gunner is definitely the highlight of this music drink today, this uh week. And, um, if all of y'all, happy Mother's Day out there, man. Yo, man, get your mom some, go out and celebrate, you know, take it to IHOP, take it to... I know right now it's different. Moms is different. They want to go to Roof Crips and all that stuff. So, yeah, do that, man. Get your mom a car. Get her some pocket chains or something, bro. Like, yeah, man, go out there and treat moms right. And especially happy Mother's Day to the moms that's not here, too, man. Y'all go out, celebrate, and do something with, do something for yourself, man. Celebrate your moms even though she ain't even here. You know what I'm saying? But, um, yeah, back into this music, man. Oh, yeah. Do uh, I don't know who's going to drop next week, but um, I'm I'm going to be I'm going to be looking forward to that. I I got other things to look into. I gotta still listen to that party album too, man. I I gotta still listen to that. But um, yeah uh yeah I gotta still listen to the party album. Yeah, cause that that Drake vs Kendrick thing that thing uh really uh put a halt on all music. But I'm glad I listened to that. That four bass is definitely dope. And I like I like his sound. I like where he's going. Um, I'm I'm and I'm very interested. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pay attention to more because it is weird that maybe maybe he had a maybe I don't know what it is. They said he sound maybe it was just for like a man. I don't know. It's very interesting that I don't see you don't see OVO on his album. So like and that's kind of weird after he just signed. Like you know what I'm saying? Maybe he had it done already. Maybe it was like yo the, all the next stuff is gonna be OVO. But uh, I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, uh, I um back to the Drake and Kendrick. I don't think this is over, yo. Whoever Ebony Prince is, homie is straight wreck. He wants smoke, <laughs> like yo. So I don't know if it was smart for Drake to really like come out and say all this lying stuff because I knew the people they was gonna run with it. So now people and now you see people discrediting it. Now it's like oh snap. It's kind of it's kind of getting weird now, so I don't know, man. We gonna pay attention, yo. You know if I, I feel if anything come out, I'll probably come out pop out with another video for y'all. Yo, it's your boy Roddy Too Good. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me tell me what y'all think, and definitely go check out that new music I just mentioned, bro. Cause that thing it's it's coming, alright, yo. Especially that uh, Chief Keith. Alright, bro, I'm out.